Guy Martin is experiencing life with the Lancaster bomber to see if he could have made it in bomber command. She's tight. That's my trickiest backing job yet. <laughs> A tour of duty was 30 missions, but crews knew that two in three of them wouldn't make it. There was little to help them cope with the stresses except camaraderie and the favoured tipple of rum and tea. Brim her up, boys. Brim her up. There she is. Ooh, you're a fighter. No, it wasn't just rum and tea. The RAF issued wakey wakey pills, which were speed, amphetamine. Uh, they weren't all into it, they weren't all into it, but those that were, um, wouldn't really take it to keep them going. You know, they'd save it for a bit of a weekend upper. Why, God, I've never seen anything like this before. Neither have I. This 1943 recording paints a picture of what bomber crews faced. Keep the eyes peeled. Yeah. Well, I can read my watch in the searchlight. They've been spotted, then. You think there's only one thing coming next, wouldn't you? Don't worry, mate, I'm on it. They're firing at us now. I yeah. think we've been hit personally. Yeah. Uh, hello, Skipper. Hello. We've been holding the front there. OK. The, uh, oil's leaking out of the front side, so there's nothing to worry about. OK. OK. I'm not getting too stressed about the job. Calm as calm. Fair play, old boys. Quite relaxed, very matter of fact about it. A little bit of crack. The hole for a bit of that. Yeah. Making light of the situation, I suppose you've got to, haven't you? Hey, even your mates shot down. You know, you're going to be coming back with far less mates every night, aren't you? Hey, you'll be making light of it in some way, or how else are you going to get to the end of the war? Hey? Bloody hell. Bloody hell. That's nice, that, that rum. <laughs>